Good morning, everybody. I am Russ. This is Chris. And, uh, man, can can I just say this? Because it, it, it ain't going to no, be. No, you can't. It ain't going to be released for a while. But after yesterday's shoot, I feel like we have improved on a lot of stuff. Would you agree? It's almost like we went from that little karaoke machine to a Marshall amp. Yeah. And once we have that amp, we can take it to somebody that can just sweeten that little bit. But, man, let me just say, good job yesterday to you. Good Thank job you. to Maddie. Good job to Tim. Good job to Hoke, who we had to put in at the last second. And you, you will see oh. you will see Tim having to make a little fall about six or eight times. Sure did. And uh, he goes balls in every time. I'm yes. so happy about <clears> that. <throat> Tonight's so, bowling. Tonight's bowling. I'm ready. I'm excited. Can I can I start it? Yeah, go ahead. Okay. You're about to get married. I am married. We have somebody else that was married, and we know another couple that's married. Where this kind of not for us, but I just want to kind of bring this in to see what you guys think about this. Yesterday in the conversation I was having was, I started this business. I started this business, and my wife is here. Now, in the business, there's more than just, there's other people involved in the business and all this, and now it's kind of like, well, hey, I'm going to give you my input on your the, business, the business that you started and you created because somebody else is coming aboard for some help and stuff like that. And it went, I'm going to go, you can't, you can't, that was well, like, it's like Stephanie going, hey, this is, uh, the backyard's my place. You guys can't, whoa, this is my place now. That ain't Stephanie's place. That's mine and yours and Brazil's <laughs> and Brian. You don't have the right to tell anybody else this is my place. And I'm just using Stephanie as an example because, of the situation that went into yesterday's conversation. So you're saying Stephanie went, this is... Yeah, there was a... The back, the backyard. It, my company, the backyard. Yes, in the conversation. Or our company, the backyard. Yes, in the conversation with the new... Oh, with, the, oh. with, the, with, the, with the person coming in and the, the conversation without... I'm just throwing me out there or throwing me back. Without me being there was, whoa, hey, this is my place now. If I don't want you here, you ain't coming here. And as I was, he, I was being told that I went. That's not, that's not Stephanie's place. Stephanie can't tell a customer I don't want you here. Stephanie can't say nothing to another person coming in there. She can look at me and go, I wouldn't like that person to ever come back because she's in love with her. Uh -huh. And but you can't. <clears throat> and I'm going. And our sponsor of the day is Shane and and Kevin at at, at C C I T S. And I was gonna go. Does Amanda get to tell? Shane, uh, I don't want you working on that person's house. I don't like her, so you don't get to go over there and work on that. Well, she can dang sure say it. To Shane. To Shane. But you can't say it to yeah. that person. Joe's standing here. Yeah. You, And I want your input on that because there's a lot of our friends that have their own business and stuff and go, you see where I'm going with this. I mean, you're fisting to get married. I mean, well, I know, I know that I know that you and Stephanie have conversations, Red Sea conversations, backyard conversations. Yeah. Just like I have at my house. Right. And sometimes I ask opinions. Oh, hey, what do you think about this? Hey, what you you like yeah. steak balls? Hey, uh, we get complaints on so and so. Has you ever been rude to you? You know, yeah. those type things. But it's never you. You gotta. Yeah, and it's never, you can't do that to somebody. It'd be like me telling Gerald, hey. You well, better not sell that car to that sell person. sell that car. Well, I dang sure can. You don't have nothing to do. Or Sheila telling Gerald, <clears throat> you don't sell that car to that person because I don't like that person. It don't matter who you like. <laughs> Let me tell you something that happened to us. We went into a partnership with someone, and there was a page in the contract. That we had to bring home and get signed. I didn't, because I wasn't married yet. But everybody in the deal had to get signed, and it was. If you were to go away, yeah, death, whatever, yeah, I ain't doing business with your spouse. That's exactly right. And it wasn't just female. 
because there's a female involved in it. Right. And she had her husband had to sign off that if something happens to her, you well, just got to buy him out. Yeah. Because they don't want it. They, these people are the only people involved. I totally And agree. once they're gone, you just got to buy that spouse out. Thought that was pretty. I like that. Yeah. It really did. And it made sense. And, and it doesn't leave the spouse out. The spouse is going to get paid. You're getting paid out. You just don't have decisions in a business you don't know. So that was my, and as we got to talking more, I went, dude, you can't. I said, you can't. You started this business. Who you're bringing in for this other part to help with. I said, there's no right for your significant other to, to have the conversation with this person and go, hey, uh, we, you can't, you're not going to do that with us. As backyard owners, there are a lot of people that walk through that door that I wish we could put a sign up up front and go, you are not allowed. Yeah. And you can. You can refuse service. I agree. But that's just because of a personal thing. You know what I mean? Yeah. So I can't go rust. I don't I don't want uh, Bob in here because that, remember that one time? Yeah, yeah. He's like, that's stupid, dude. He's coming in here yeah. to spend money. He's causing no trouble. But, You're just but being petty. The Yeah, that, that's the deal. And I think that's a lot of it. You that's the deal. And the thing I was going was, it it would be, for me, I would be like, it don't make a crap what you, you know. It, it But it would be like Brooks saying he couldn't come in. Right. I'd be like, why, why are you? Or Stephanie saying she can't come in. Just because you don't like her don't mean she can't come here. You're not. And I have heard this from the me. beauty of backyard. It's big enough that you don't have to be around people yeah. you don't want. But, but most times it ain't women bad. or men, because they are women that have their own business. If your significant other started that business, ran that business before you, it ain't your business. Now, it'll never. Now let's add. Let's it'll add never this. Be your business. I start this business, and I bring her in as a partner. Partner, partner. Okay. Totally different deal. It changes. It changes. Totally if I different. bring her in and pay her to do a job, still mine. Still yours. I totally. Okay. If you bring, I'm going to do me. There's four of us that own backyard. Stephanie knows everything that goes on down there. But she has not one right to talk to an employee, to talk to a customer, in a way of being an owner. Just because she's associated with an owner. She is more than welcome to come around the corner and go, Russell, there's somebody around there not doing their job or whatever. I totally and that it. has happened. Yes, I totally agree <laughs> with that. But I, we have seen, and I want your opinions. I want your opinions. Anybody who does that is causing a lot of trouble at home. I agree. It, it causes trouble at home. I agree. You know, you Brooke can come home me. from her job and go, so-and-so, and I go, well, you ought to just tell him or yeah. tell her. Yeah. That, you want me to go tell him? That's exactly right. Because uh, I can't. Yeah. Uh, you're at, that is absolutely <clears throat> right. What is your opinion on that? Because as we were talking yesterday, I was really like, wow, man, it's not just you. I mean, it's no different than, you know, Carmen, who does all the cars, and then Billy... It's going to come in with the car deal. Well, the great thing is, Billy's awesome at running numbers at Coke. So hard to, hard to tell me how to do this job if you don't know this job or have not started this job. And it goes so far that I just want to know other people. There's opinion. some battles you can't fight for your spouse. Yeah, I and agree I, with and that. I, and, you know, if, if you're in business, if, if, if I'm in business with somebody she doesn't get along with, then she just doesn't need to go to that meeting or yeah. go to the, their establishment or whatever uh, yeah. it is. You just got to stay away because at the end of the day, that person's writing me a check. For now, all. now if they have oh, sexually assaulted you, yeah. have verbally assaulted yeah. you, I wouldn't be doing business with them anyway. Yeah, that's a total different deal. You know what I mean? Yeah. If they have, if I know I there's something serious they have done to me or you, as my wife or girlfriend or whatever. Then I would go. You know what, man? I just can't do yeah. business with you. That that I, I totally agree with. You wouldn't have to stand up for us. There I would is. already stand yeah. up for us. I want your opinion today. I want your opinion. And it's not a 
This ain't a, oh, hell no, I don't let my wife or my husband do nothing in my state. I want to know what, if, what, 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 what would you do? What, what would that situation be? Uh, we got to give a shout out to Shane and them. They do a lot of good stuff for us. They really do. <laughs> they, finally got their, they finally got their number. They're actually legal, so they can do legal and stuff. And we actually got it legal right up here. Yeah, legal on the banner. Eight, so, it B O three O seven B R five four nine nine one. It could be something like that. Something yeah. like that. Good something job, like that. Good anyway, job. uh, networking. Yep. Alarms, sound, sound, cameras, massages. I think massages. just depends on where they're going. They do it all. They have done it all. They have done massages. And usually so, they don't charge for those. No, no. That just comes, comes in after the cameras are installed. It's after work yeah. time. So we appreciate that, Shane. And uh, we really do appreciate that. We got to put these two pictures up. Yeah. Okay. Actually, I think it's just my one picture now. This is Mr. Tommy Miller. Look at this. Look at that right there. It don't even. Look at that right there. Tommy, how old are you right there? Kathy, I want you and Tommy, how old are y'all right there? Yeah, somebody comment under there and say what Kathy, year that Kathy, was. Kathy, you tell us. That is an OG from back in the day. I'm, let's let's make a guess on the year. I'm going to go early 70s. With the outfit, I'm going to go... I'm going 73. Ooh, okay. I'm going to go... My dad was still wearing some of them outfits. The sideburns are in. I'm going to go 71. 71 and 73. 71 and 73. Kathy, tell us what it is. You um, know what? Comment later. Everybody else make a guess what yeah, year it yeah. was. But they have been together so long. Our dear friend, Mr. Tommy Miller, man. Awesome guy. Kathy watches the show. Thank you so much. And sponsors. We'll be at the Backyard Monday. First one to get us, hit us back. Come down, be part of the show. Yeah, be part of the show. I know Shane and them been wanting to. They're sponsored today, but they want to bring us something. Ooh, that camera that broke? That massage. No, oh. they already got that. Oh, got that. yeah, I'll take the massage. I'll take the massage. Have a wonderful day, man. We're going to get out of here. Uh, we'll be back on Monday. We'll be at the backyard. I'll do the best of this week. I'm excited about that. <clears throat> proud of you for training, finally. <laughs> Finally proud of you for training. Hey, tomorrow night, Casey Donahue, the night after William Clark Green. I, you really can't beat that back-to-back -back two line. shows. That's going to be a good one. And I promise you today, you will watch after the show the trailer to a killing that's on Amazon Prime. It was named Falls County, but we changed it just because you want, you've got to have a title for better numbers right. on Amazon. I forgot all week. So enjoy the trailer. And then go to Amazon Prime, watch our stuff, man. We'd appreciate it because that's what we're about to do. You'll see the teaser, hopefully Monday or Tuesday, and we'll be shooting the series in a couple of months, and I'm so excited about this. So, it's so good. All right, you got anything else to say? 600 tonight? Uh, yeah. I hope. Well, at least one of us. Yeah, together we'll get it. Until Monday, I am Russ. This is Chris. We are out. Well, I don't really know where to begin. It's kind of hard to say where it all started. Just try your best to lay the facts down. Texas Rangers got involved and did their job. Prince matched a career criminal by the name of Brian Lee Post. I came up on his right side, gun at the ready, and I fired a shot right to his head. I watched him die.